Hey guys, how's it going? I made this video before I completed my body shell, but the reason I didn't release this video is because I didn't want to give away the color that I was doing my body shell. So the reason I'm making this video now is because when I had purchased this product, I was told by the very experienced shop owner that this product goes on before your color on the inside of the body. Luckily, I decided to do some research, try to see how other people turned out using this product. By the way, this is the PS55 Tamiya Flat Clear. And I'm trying to um, produce a new body um, that's like a flat matte finish. So the gentleman that sold it to me said, you mask off on the inside everywhere, you don't want this. Spray it. Let it dry, obviously, and then peel off all your masks and spray your color. Sounds good to me. That's, that's what I was hoping for. Because every video that I decided to look up and see how it does, how it looks after, everyone's telling me to put this on the outside of the body. The thing is that all the videos I've watched, they're all spraying this on a body that's been painted already. So. Rather than continue to search for someone who actually bought this when making a new body, as opposed to buying it for their existingly painted body, I'm going to try what the shop order suggested. I'm going to try on this little piece of uh, Lexan uh, that I cut away from my new body. Uh, I put a very similar uh, design that I plan on using on my body. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to spray this piece of Lexan on the inside, which would be this part, because the uh, peel is on this part, to peel it off. And I want to see if uh, it'll work that way, because so far every video I've watched, everyone says because of the shininess of the, of the Lexan, it's not going to make it look matte if you paint it on the inside. So I'm going to do my own experiment, and we're going to put this... Uh, to the test and I'll be able to find I'll be able to answer my own question and hopefully I'll be able to answer anybody who had questions looking for this answer so here we go okay guys so I've got my piece painted I uh, kind of I already scraped it a little bit see <laughs> anyway so I've got my piece painted uh, I can sort of see the lines where I had my mask the rest should look more of a matte once I peel this off. Let's see what the results are. And just to let you know, right on the can, it says to spray on the inside before your main coat. All right, it's still quite glossy from the Lexan. However, there is quite a difference between the stripe and where I sprayed the uh, flat clear. So maybe I'll need to let this dry a little bit more, but it, it, it's definitely giving me more of a sheen where it wasn't. I don't know if you can see that in the camera. I'm gonna turn it back and forth so that maybe you can see the reflection off it. So, the, the way that it instructs you to use it, it says right here on the can uh, for use, paint the transparent Lexan polycarbonate body from the inside. It says it right on the can of this product. So will it work from the inside before you put your color? Yes, it will. You'll still get that glossy look, however, from the Lexan itself. But it definitely makes, makes it less glossy, for sure, for sure. I, I, can, I can see uh, a lot more of the metallics in this paint, actually, where the flat was not sprayed. It's a lot, it's a lot shinier. It's, both of them are glossy, but it, it seems where the, where the masking was on the lines that I made, it is glossier, shinier. It, it, so it looks like it's working the way that it says it works, the way that 
Nobody online apparently says you're supposed to use it. Now, I can see how it would work if you were to spray it on the outside of the Lexan. I'm not saying they're wrong. But according to Tamiya, you're supposed to put it on before your base color, on the inside of the body. So in this case, I would say either, either way works. I would say do it on the inside of a new body anyway, and if it's too glossy for you still, then do it on the outside. But uh, this looks fantastic. This is almost the exact look that I'm planning on getting on this body, where I, I don't want the lines to be completely in your face. I want them to be sort of viewable from certain angles and certain shots. So that, that works really good. This is actually the effect that I was hoping for. I was hoping maybe it would be a little bit more matte, but I'm using a very high metallic paint. So I think that also has something to do with it, why it's not quite as matte. And also I didn't use a whole lot of it for this experiment. I didn't want to use it all up for the experiment and then perhaps run out of what I need to actually do the body. Same with the color. I, I tried not to use too much of my color either. But, uh, so there you go. If you were looking for the same answer I was looking for, yes, you are supposed to put this product, PS55, on the inside of the body before you spray your color. Uh, it will work. Um, and if that doesn't work to your satisfaction, okay, then put it on the outside of the body where it, it will actually protect the body. It, is, it does form quite a good coat. Um, but remember, if you're putting it on the outside of your body, uh, definitely you want to mask off all the stuff that you don't want to have it on. So for me, I have to mask off the inside, and then if I don't like it, I'm going to have to mask off my lines on the outside after and redo it on the outside as well. All right, so I hope you uh, liked this video. I hope it answered your question about PS55 Tamiya or any flat clear coat for that matter. I'm pretty sure they all work the same way. You're supposed to put them on the inside before your color, and yes, you can also use it on the outside of a previously painted body as well to get a matte finish as well, okay? So both will work to answer your question. I suggest start on the inside, not good enough, then do the outside, all right? Hope you like this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want some more. Uh, I'm still working on the body. Although by the time I release this video, my body should be finished already. <laughs> keep on RCing, keep on keeping on, ciao.